I still feel a little suspicious when I hear binaries and dualities, you know? <laughs> like <laughs> Okay, let's see let's see if we can dissolve that duality there for you. Uh, okay, thank you. <laughs> yeah. I mean, actually there's only one world, mm-hmm. which is the world. And in that world there are different neighborhoods. So you could think of all the material universes as just sort of like, you know, that's the a neighborhood. It's kind of like the penitentiary. So the material world is just, Prabhupada once said, it's like a cloud in the spiritual sky. Because if you think about it, there's only one thing, which is reality. And there's just one reality. And in that reality, there are... Um, you know, there are higher and lower worlds based on, and, and of course, I mean, you're right, because there's all kinds of stuff going on out there in, in reality. I mean, you know, we hear about Shiva Lok and Devi Lok, and there's just, it's a big creation. It's a very big operation. But but essentially, there is what what's called in the Vedas the Paraloka, like the higher world, and and then there's this world. And, uh, but even this world is within that spiritual world. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. So I've noticed uh, in general with dualities, you can transcend them by going back to one or up to three. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we, we took the two worlds, made it one world with little parts inside. That- and yeah, duality also has the sense, the way Krishna uses the word dwandwa, duality. In fact, the word dwa, duo, I mean, you know, our English is from the Sanskrit. And so, um, dualistic, dwandva. So, when Krishna talks about dwandva, duality in the Gita, he's really talking about polarities. It's like, you know, victory and defeat, pain and pleasure, heat and cold. He's really talking about, I mean, so the word duality doesn't only mean there's two of something, it means there's somehow an opposition. Mm. So here's the word duality in the dictionary, the uh, often awful Apple dictionary. The quality or condition of being dual, that didn't help, an instance of, an instance of opposition or contrast between two concepts or two aspects of something, a dualism. An example, they give the photographs capitalize on the dualities of light and dark. So, for example, we learned that in Vaikuntha, in the spiritual world, spiritual sky, there are innumerable spiritual planets, by Kunta planets, but there's no opposition, and so there, it's, not, it's not dual. Oh, uh, okay. So Krishna, Krishna would not really call the material and spiritual worlds a duality. At least Krishna is using the word duality to mean oppositions, polarities, things that, you know, <laughs> against each other in some way, like light and dark. <laughs> 